Hi, my name is Attorney Walter, if not the third, I'm with Disability Resolution PA. Let's go ahead and begin with the question. The question is, what are the 10 different levels of disability representatives and why do they all get paid the same amount? We just went through all the way through to number eight, now we're going to be doing number nine, but let me give you a recap as to the first eight. These are the people that can actually represent you and charge a fee before the Social Security Administration. This is the bottom level, here's the muck. Friends and family members, case workers, disability advocates, certified disability advocates, law school dropouts, Graduate, uh, graduates of law school but couldn't pass the bar, so they kept failing the bar and couldn't get through it. Lawyer, federal registered lawyer, right? And now the next one, which is the true final, number nine is it. Number 10 doesn't exist, but it might one day, but number nine is it. That's an attorney with a specialized certificate, okay? So that's kind of like a postdoctorate certificate um, in doing a specific field of law. In Social Security Disability, they do have a certificate for specialization for Social Security Disability Benefits. You have to be doing Social Security Disability Benefits almost in entirety. You know, the mass, uh, the largest amount of your work has to be based in that field. You have to meet all these other requirements, be doing that for five years, and then you can apply for that certification. So under my firm, I've been working for seven years, you know, basically as an attorney doing almost solely, almost, and it wasn't almost, in the very beginning it was almost solely, but almost solely now, Social Security Disability Based Benefits. So what you need to know is that I have not taken the exam yet. I was going to take the exam this year, but then we got hit with this whole COVID thing and now I can't take the exam. I am not worried about the exam. I'm not worried about passing the exam, but I had to wait five years and because I bought the house and things were going on, I was like, well, whatever. I don't really need it to prove that I know how to do this stuff because as you guys know, I've done probably over 40,000 claims between all the other law firms I've worked for and all the people that I've represented. So I've done lots and lots and lots and lots of claims. I've won lots and lots and lots and lots of claims. And I know lots and lots and lots about this system. So the bottom line is I have not gotten my specialty certification in this field yet, but I will shortly once I take the exam, once a proctor for the exam can go ahead and proctor the exam for me, which is probably gonna have to come out for this whole COVID thing. But if you can, hire an attorney that has one of those. Are they absolutely necessary? No. Is it a nice shiny star on the resume of your attorney that's better than an attorney that doesn't have one? Yes. Is it something that you need to win your social security disability benefits? Not at all. It's just basically a higher level thing for us to have to advertise to say we know what we're doing. But most attorneys don't even go out and get it. Most attorneys that have been practicing for 40 years don't go and get it. Most attorneys that have been practicing for 30 years don't go and get it. Most attorneys that have been practicing for 20 years don't go and get it. I'm only going to go and get it because the attorneys I used to work for, well, one of them has it. Actually, two of them has it. All the other attorneys that do this stuff in, in like, you know, Florida that I work with or worked with, you know, before I became an attorney, they don't have it because they don't need it. It's just, it's a fanciful thing to add on top of what you already know. The next one, number 10, right? Because we're going through this list, one through 10, doesn't exist. So you can stop the videos now, but if you want to know what that like, you know, the unique potential unicorn one of the future is going to be, number 10 is that, all right? My name is Attorney Walter Fnall III, I'm with Disability Resolution PA. If you want, dot, 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 um, a particular video made about a particular topic, that's fine, shoot me an email or give me a call, or if you want me to give you an updated video on something, that's fine, shoot me an email or give me a call, or go with me live on, Thursday, every Thursday from 8 to 10, uh, to go ahead and call me, and we'll go ahead and run live uh, hearing questions, we'll run live, uh, you know, details about your claims, so you'll have a better understanding from my perspective about how your disability claims should be uh, properly handled, all right? So, my name is Attorney Walter Fnall III, I'm with Disability Resolution PA, an Orlando Orange County-based Social Security Disability Law Firm, I'll catch you a little bit later. Thank you so much, bye-bye.